If there's one thing I really took from this movie is that I really, really do love Benedict Cumberbatch. I just do. Doctor Strange directed by Scott Dickerson. For many years now, over decades now, we have heard that there were talks of a Doctor Strange film and we finally got it. In this Cumberbatch play, Stephen Strange, who is this amazing neurosurgeon who is, I would not say is narcissistic, but I will say that he's pretty ignorant, but at the end of the day, he is truly amazing at what he does. Due to a horrific car accident, Cumberbatch ends up losing his ability to do anything with his hands. After wasting a lot of money and using all of the modern operations that are available to try to fix his hands, he then searches around the world to try to find a way to fix his hands and really put his life back together. In his search, he is led to Tilda Swin, who plays the ancient one in this movie. Where he finds out that this world that he knows there's actually many of them. There's actually many dimensions and there's a dark dimension that I'm not going to talk about and then there's also magic so he ends up finding out all of this stuff. Stuff that you and I know we knew Cumberbatch would be good in this. He was great in this. I loved him in this and I really enjoy watching him perform his duties as a neurosurgeon. It's a great mixture of Shiwato Ijafo. I think I pronounced that right. I got it right on the first time. Holy shit. Shiwato Ijafo. Look at I butchered it again. I tried to say it again. I butchered it but she would tell Egypt for he's in this and there's a great mixture of him in this and the special effects we knew the special effects by the, the mini trailers and the promotions that this movie put out we knew that the special effects in this was was going to be great it was tremendous in this movie way in the very first scene this movie starts off pretty fast and then this movie really slows down it really slows down for about for about an hour, I would say. I'm saying it's a bad thing. You're interested in what's going on. You understand that with this being the first Doctor Strange movie, this movie really needs to establish itself. But damn, is it really slow. It just, it just really is. I mean, this is just one of those movies that needed to be probably 30 to probably 40 minutes longer. With my understanding that this movie needs to establish itself, I do understand that. And this movie does try to do that. But the last act of this movie the third act of this movie it feels really rushed and really just put together there's a lot of humor in this movie some hit some does not hit this is one character that sees this thing in this part of the movie where you would think it would scare the shit out of him but it does not or at least would pretty much shock them enough for they won't be able to perform this task but no they just continue on dr strange is not as amazing as i thought it would be i thought this movie would be truly amazing it's not but it's pretty damn good i did love it not as amazing as I thought it would be. Guys, hang around for the after credits for, of this movie. I will say that Doctor Strange is an 85 out of 100. I got to give it an 85 out of 100, guys. Get in the comment section. Let me know your thoughts about Doctor Strange. Finally happy that this movie came out and I got to see it. All of the trailers had me pumped for it. 85 out of 100. Let me know your thoughts. Until the next video, guys, I'm out.